What's up everybody? Tiffany Outdoors here and today's episode I'm going to make some strawberry crisp so you guys stay tuned. First thing I need to do is get a fire started so I can get my charcoals going. While the charcoal is getting started, I'm going to start putting this recipe together. First thing we need is one cup of oats. Three quarters of a cup of flour. half a cup of brown sugar one tablespoon of sugar one quarter of a teaspoon of salt and one quarter of a teaspoon of ginger I'll mix these dry ingredients up And then I'm going to add in six tablespoons of melted butter. Melted unsalted butter. Mix this all in. This here is going to make our base, the crust for the bottom of the apple, I mean the uh, strawberry crisp. Everything is all mixed together. I'm going to take out one cup. This is for the top. So I'm going to take out one cup of that and then we're going to put it in our foil lined Dutch oven. All right, I'm just going to pour this in here. I'm going to press it into the bottom. And get it nice and even. Nice. I'm going to add a little something else in this too. So I took a half of a brick of cream cheese and I sweetened it with a little bit of just regular granulated sugar. And I'm going to smear this into the bottom. Well, try to. Oh boy, this isn't working out so well. All right. I'm going to drop dollops of it into the bottom. So the next thing I'm going to do is sprinkle in my strawberries. Oh yeah. So what I did was I took some strawberries and diced them up. I'm just going to spread this out evenly along the bottom. Then, I'm going to sprinkle it with lemon juice. And then, on top, sprinkle our, our top. Oh, this looks so good. So, I'm going to set this on my Dutch oven cooking platform. And I'm going to bake it for 30 to 40 minutes at 350 degrees. So, theoretically... For 350 degrees to do outside cooking, you want 16 coals on the top and 10 on the bottom. And I'm not quite sure how many coals I poured in there, but I want to go ahead and dig those out and set this thing up. I got my 10 coals down here on the bottom, and I got them grouped kind of tightly together. I'm just going to set that there. And then I'm going to put 16 on the top.
Okay, y'all, there's nothing left to do but to let this stuff cook, and I'm going to come back and check in in about 20 minutes, okay? Twenty minute timer has gone off, so now let's go check our strawberry crisp. I can smell the strawberries. Oh yeah, it's bubbling. It's a bubbling. Let that go for about ten more minutes. Ten or fifteen more minutes. And I'll check back with you. All right, y'all. Moment of truth. Oh, yes. Can you see that? It is bubbling. Right there in the center. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. And the crust is a nice golden brown. Now, it's time to let this cool down. Take that off the coals, leave the lid off. I'm just going to rake my coals back into my fire pit. Oh, what's left of them? Oh yes, look at all that deliciousness. I cannot wait to eat it. So this has had a few minutes to cool, so I'm going to taste test this right out of the pot. Oh yes. Oh wow. Mm. Oh wow, that is so good. So with the cream cheese, it kind of cuts the tartness of the strawberries. If you don't like it too tart, you can always sprinkle a little bit of sugar on top of the strawberries before you cook it. But, oh, mm, with the cream cheese in there, that is really, really good. Mm. Yeah, that's good. I want to thank you for joining me today and if you like today's episode hit that like button and make sure you are subscribed so you don't miss any new episodes of tiffany outdoors you can also follow me on instagram and twitter and i will see you guys later bye